Michelle Joel with spalaska.com and I would love to go to Alaska. But what do I wear? And I need to be warm and chic because I'm still coming from New York City. So I'm paired with Valeria Carano, um, stylist in New York City. And uh, you're gonna show me what I need to bring and yeah, we're gonna, gonna we'll pack your suitcase for you. We are going to be focusing on versatile looks that you can kind of mix and match. Comfort, number one, warmth. But again, you're coming from New York City with a New York City stylist, so you have to bring a little bit of home. <laughs> Sounds great, where do we start? <laughs> okay, so let's go to Sada Boutique and see what they have. Um, these are great gloves because again, you have the military green, they're echo, you have the leather on the, you know, on the hand so you can actually grip things. Great. And look. Oh, they match. They look good. Yes, we have our neutrals here mixed in with our military green. So let's grab a pair of these. Okay. And then you're going to need a hat also. Okay. It's cold again. Okay. So um, let's go look at hats over here. Look at this one with the fur down the front. That's super cute. And you know the bomb bombs are huge now. I'm so. try it on. <laughs> <laughs> and you have your jacket already, right? Yes. for a little bit more. <laughs> and then here's another hat that I slotted earlier that I love because oh, I, I really am into the animal print. I feel like every woman should wear at least one piece of animal print when she goes out because... Let me try that one, actually. And this is more of like a beanie style. Oh, okay. Um, and you, know, you can wear that with black, okay. gray, silver, I'll try this one on deep too. blue. Valeria? Yes. Can you describe this, the first outfit? So what I did with this outfit was I was kind of getting a feel for Alaskan chic and glamour. I toned down the outfit itself by pairing blacks of different materials together. So what I did was I have this lace fitted bodice underneath a rabbit fur poncho. I like the play on textures together. The rabbit fur poncho also has this leather strap that you can kind of adjust the collar. I leave it as a cowl neck. Um, and I paired it with black skinny cargos because again we're hiking in Alaska so we don't want to be too over the top but we still want to look nice. Um, snow boots of course and then to kind of play up on the black and play with color I added some pops. Popping purple gloves, popping leather turquoise hobo and a silk scarf with um, you know Native American inspired patterns. So I think that when you pair this all together, we want the basic black, but then we want something that says, I know what, you know, I know how to dress, I know how to look good, and I can play with color. So that's what we did with the accessories. So basically the look we have here on Michelle is more of a neutral toned down look. We'll say this time we're gonna go um, whale watching. This is the look we're going to wear when we whale watch. So basically, we're very neutral. I, I love this vest because it is very feminine with the ruffles here and the fur along the hood, the faux fur. Very cute. <laughs> um, the Mary Mecco necklace kind of adds a little bit of a voom to this and it, it pairs easily with these Echo gloves. Um, and they're long. They go up past her elbow, which I think is glamorous and warm. And they have the leather easily gripping. It's a great outfit. Isn't it cute? It's comfortable too, right? Yes, great. Um, easily you know, accessible, easy to move in. I. Oh, sorry. This, I love clutches. I think they're very cute. I like the envelope style on this, and I also like the texture, the snakeskin texture here. So, so we're, we're definitely playing a lot with textures because I feel like that enhances style. You don't want plain. You don't want something that just hangs there. You want, you want energy. You want texture. And then lastly, we have the mini Tonka moccasins, which are the most amazing shoes in the world. They are so comfortable. They are. They're very squishy. So comfortable. You can wear them with socks, without socks, they're just amazing. It's like slippers. Um, so you'll be on your feet all day looking for whales. You need to have nice shoes on. <laughs> and you'll be warm. <laughs> it's getting crazier and crazier, can you tell? What adventure could I go in this outfit? Well, on your itinerary, you had seaplane riding. So when I put this outfit together, I had seaplane riding in mind. Um, warmth, but... Okay but easily, you know, you can move around one side of the plane to the other to see the view. <laughs> so let me just explain a little bit about what I did when I put this together. So cute. You like it? Are you I like comfortable? it. It's great. The important thing is that you're comfortable and you're warm. 
Those I are... feel very warm. I'm a little sweaty. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. No, it's, okay. it's so it's so warm and layered. There's I don't look bulky. I'm warm without feeling the bulk. Exactly. That's exactly what we were trying to do here. So I'm glad that you said that. Um, I think I'll start with the leggings. So these leggings are cream, and they are eco-friendly, which is the best part about wearing these because the designer, Raina Blyer, created cream um, as an eco-friendly line, and it's also yoga. You don't have to wear these doing yoga. I mean, we I wear leggings and yoga pants almost every day. They're comfortable. You can move around. They make sense. So that's why I put these on you I like I like the ridges. It gives them so much more style. Yeah, it does. And they're not black, which is what I like too, because so many people put on black leggings and it can get boring. These are nice because they kind of they're a grayish blue and they tie in with everything else we put together. Um, which brings me to my next piece. This is a faux fur cropped jacket, which is like also yours. like mine. Yay! Because <laughs> it's also going with the whole eco friendly feel. We, you know, maybe some people don't want to wear real fur. Maybe they want to wear articles of clothing where they feel like they're helping the environment. We have something for everyone here, so that's why I put you in this, and they're a great pair together. Um, and then, of course, the long linen white shirt because it's comfortable. And the important part of this is it's such an easy outfit to put on. It's so easy, and it's so comfortable, but you look good. I look like I'm put together. You look like you're put together. And then, of course, the hat because the beanie. The hat's just amazing <laughs> and warm. What, what kind of hat? What do you call this kind of hat? Is it a beret? I mean, yeah, I guess you can call it a beret, yeah. Okay. A winterized beret. Nice. With a little bit of cheetah print. And some pearls. And some pearls. And you can get these at Sada Boutique. I like it. I like this outfit. Good, I'm glad. Exactly. Basically, we had to represent here because we're New Yorkers. <laughs> but we wanted to keep our Alaskan chic theme, which is exactly what we have. The look that we have now is very classic because you can always have trends, you can always have fun, but at the end of the day, you should always have your classic pieces. We have this fur. This is not faux fur, um, and I'm sorry, but this is... This is a real this one. This is a real fur right here. Um, what I was thinking when I when I styled you in this outfit was, again, versatility and comfort, but nice. When you're going out in the town, when you're going to the spa, when you're going to lunch, you want to look put together, you want to look like you're nicely dressed. So basically what I did, we have you in heels now because you're not trudging through snow anymore, you're not riding airplanes, you're not fishing or hunting or hiking, <laughs> you're going to the spa, you're going shopping, you're getting to know the locals and really seeing the cute towns that Alaska is also known for. So I have that. I also have, again, Cream Collections leggings, eco-friendly. However, these are not just leggings, so don't be fooled. This is a one piece because Alaska is cold in the winter and we want to keep warm. So this one piece it adds added there. warmth. It goes up there and it ties. It's adjustable. It, it ties at the strap. So, you know, depending on how tall you are, you can adjust that. And what we did was we put Cream Collections shirt over this just so you feel a little more comfortable. Adding a, a, an extra layer. The stripes are great. I like the stripe contrast. I like it. It's very with cute. With the equestrian style belt. Um, sometimes it's fun to play with with designs also. You don't always have to have, okay, if you're wearing a striped shirt, I can't wear any more patterns. No, play around. Play with the, praise, the paisley pattern on the belt with the stripes. Okay. It's okay. And the cable knits in the sweater. I like this. This is so cozy. It's so cozy, right? <laughs> okay, and I want you to try this hat on because I love, love, love. Okay. Amazing! It looks so good! See how, okay, here's another thing that I want our viewers to remember. Look what a transformation one accessory did without the hat, okay? She still looks amazing, yes, but then add something as simple as this wool fedora, and look, it puts it together. It's just like the cherry on top. It looks so good. They're winter colors. Again, you have the eco-friendly cream collection, and as long as you're comfortable, I think that's There's one of the my most walk. important things. <laughs> Is that what you're going to do down the street? Yes, Alaska. Hi. Here's the show. <laughs> Hello. This is definitely one of my favorite looks, and it's definitely you, for sure. <laughs>